What is this game? It looks cool. <laughs> Good old World of Warcraft. First time watching WoW stream. Nice. I haven't been on WoW for a bit. Yeah. Do you, do you guys like the ultra wide for WoW? I think could, I think the ultra wide for WoW could actually be sick. I think it could actually be really cool. But yeah, this is gonna be a little bit of a tech demo. To figure out to get our WoW set up all nice. So is, it looks okay widescreen because what we could do is I, is I could I could cut off the sides of the screen or I could move my all my UI in so that the whole screen is taken up. What even is my covenant right now? Am I Night Fae? No, I'm Necrolord. I think Necrolord's actually okay for for Fury too. I kind of want to play Night Fae again though. What should I play, Necrolord or like... I want to play Night Fae. All right, let me just go back to Night Fae. How hard... You, you literally can just swap covenants, right? I'm just gonna go back to Night Fae, I think. Should I play Night Fae or Kyrian? I feel like Kyrian... I feel like Kyrian Fury is gonna be insane. Yeah, I feel like... I feel like Kyrian Fury is gonna be so insane. And I actually have half decent like Kyrian stuff, I think. I don't think Kyrian's just not my favorite, but I I think Night Fae's my favorite. But it's just unfortunate that that their their legendary is just so not good. I, I love Night Fae, but I, I just their their legendary just isn't good enough. I'll just I'll just play Kyrian, I think. Necrolord's cool, but uh, uh, but then then if I play Kyrian, I have to buff. I have to do my little follower every every game. Oh no. So Conqueror's Banner affects one additional ally, so it affects all your friends in threes. And every 25 rage you spend while it is active increases the duration of your banner by five seconds. So whenever you, basically whenever you rampage, you're getting like another second and a half. But I, I haven't, I haven't unlocked any other guys. I, I'd, I'd have to like actually make my spec just straight fury. And, and all my arms conduits are actually the ones that are pumped up. My fury conduits are... Still not too hot, I don't think. Because I, I feel like I feel like Spear Blade Storm, like every minute, is kind of insane. Necro is pretty straightforward and pretty good. The healing that you get from Fleshcraft is pretty insane too. Maybe we just do this then. Just play uh, Necro Lord. The Necro Lord healing and shielding is pretty nice. I'll just play Necro. I feel like Necro is probably fine. All right, let me just go fix my uh, my stuff and then we'll we'll just play uh, we'll just play this for a little while. Yeah, we'll just do Necro twos. That sounds fine. That sounds good. So we're gonna set up some of this. Depths of insanity. Vicious contempt seems like it could be fun. This would be insane for uh, for your big burst mode. Maybe indelible victory. I mean, I don't really use ignore pain very much as fury. Maybe I should though. Which one am I gonna play for the talents? Double time is pretty fun for PVE. Just be a tank though. What a frenzy talent? Uh, I guess I was using, using Massacre <laughs> last time I logged in for big, big executes. But Frenzy, I think, is pretty good. Probably for Arena. Stacking stuff up. But if we're just going to be like war, like world questing, we probably don't really need that, right? Can you change these anywhere? You should be able to change this anywhere pretty soon. Double time would be nice. I'm trying to think of what I'm going to be doing, though. Let's try this out. Sup. All right. So now we just gotta hit up old Zareth Mortis, huh? How do you get to Zareth Mortis? Gotta talk to this guy? Okay. The way is open. Whoa, dude. Send me in. Let's go. The dream. Oh, look at this. I think this zone really look, has looked good from just what I've seen Jenny playing. <gasps> oh, no. It's awfully pretty, isn't it? Looks really pretty. The widescreen looks great, too. It's ultra wide beauty. Yeah, it looks awesome, huh? This one is awesome. Can you guys hear the music pretty good, too? Music's great, yeah. Beautiful. Stop playing WoW the first month of Ding and 60. Is it accessible to come back and play or is it too big of a gap? No, you, like, the way that WoW works is that every new patch is that, like, they, you basically um, can really easily catch up to that new patch. This patch sounds great, and I've waited a little bit of time to come play it, which is, you know, not really for this reason, but um, that does allow me to kind of come back and have, like, a little bit of, like, catch up and yeah we usually listen to different music but I'm, I'm kind of getting myself immersed in this zone this is gorgeous i really like this zone it's like a cheat death thing cypher equipment interesting 
Good luck in your future endeavors. Interesting. Increases movement and mounted speed in outdoor Shadowlands zones. And you can level it up too. That's cool. I have to make those, dude. I have to make those. 1500 Cosmic Flux. Okay, to convert an item into two. Okay, I don't really know how to... I don't really know any of that stuff. I guess we'll find out, won't we? Then you, you just get Cosmic Flux from just doing stuff. Is that right? But, so, does the... When you, when you craft your tier set, is the eye level of the tier gear stuck at whatever you crafted it at? Or can you upgrade the tier gear eye level? I wasn't like I wasn't super clear on that when we were talking about earlier. Be careful. Do you need shards anymore? Shards of domination? Are those a thing anymore? Probably not. Well, I feel like some of this stuff is like halfway rest bonus, right? Like kind of. Cosmic flux, baby. Let's go. Making gains. Cause some of this stuff is like catch up, right? Like you get like I can make a couple different uh make like two different tier pieces, right? Two different tier thingies. Can I say in short what they did for Dragonflight PvP? Well, they, I mean, the, the expansion's not coming out for probably like a year. But some of the things that they're planning to do that were like highlights from the discussion we had with Linka are they're trying to sort of like make gear fairly standardized without like all these little different upgrades and stuff. It's just like you have honor gear and you have conquest gear. That's all there is. That's, the eye level is the same. Like, all the conquest gear is the same eye level, all the honor gear is the same eye level. That's just all there is. Um, and they're working towards, uh, more rated solo queue, which is pretty cool, too. Those are, like, the big ones. Yeah, rated solo queue is kind of, like, one of, like, the, the big, like, objectives moving forward. And it's sort of like a WAD-style gearing system, where it's just, like, you get your, you get your honor gear, then you get your conquest gear, that's it. But you still will be able to upgrade the gear's PvE eye level, just, the PvP eye level will be static. You don't have to worry about that part. I've played multiple MMOs at the same time before. It's kind of hard to do, but it's like, how do I do- I was like, what the fuck? What's this? <laughs> do I have to fight myself? Like it's literally this is literally sinful gladiator Bajira. Like it, it like the tooltip actually shows me. Like my tooltip. Holy shit. Dude, I should bait this guy. I should take off all my gear. Hold on. Shadow bolt, you You've gotta be kidding me. Kind of Imposter. Got a shadow bolt. Get out of that form. Oh, it's it's literally Malganus. Holy shit, okay. Do I just, do I just go turn this in? <laughs> just like, just walk away and turn this in? It, the, the comments that you guys are like happy to see me playing WoW again are very sweet. You guys happy to see me back in the WoW section? That, that's, that's very heartwarming and I appreciate it truly. Xerath Mortis better than Corthia? Yeah, Corthia is fine, but this is amazing. I, I really like the way this looks. Like I've been saying, I, I've been spamming you guys on stream. Every time we play Lost Ark, I'm like, man, we gotta find a way to play some WoW. I'm, I'm gonna work on it, man. I'm gonna try. That was insane. Wow, what a what a scene widescreen too. Are you guys are you guys digging this widescreen for WoW? It actually I, I like it a lot. As long as it doesn't bother you guys as a like for from a viewing perspective, it actually looks sick for me. Not to bring in any sort of negativity in here, but like I am glad that people are mostly like sort of bringing the good vibes when it comes to WoW. I feel like for a little while there, especially with the controversy at Blizzard and all that stuff, and it was it was definitely like not really great vibes. But our stream was always great, but I think that generally people are excited and, and happy and supportive of the devs. And that's like by far in a way what I prefer. And that's kind of what I liked about like playing New World is people are just excited about the game. Now people with Lost Ark, people are just excited about the game. That's, that's where I want to get back to. That's just a, such a much better feeling, you know what I mean? Just is. The thing is that WoW, WoW continues to innovate. It continues to expand and do new and cool stuff. And what's what's neat is that like from the people that we were seeing maybe it was just the presentation But it seemed like the people who were working on wow the devs that they had like in the uh, announcements up there They're all like kind of young You know so there might be like some fresh blood working on wow like all the like people like us who have like grown up with wow they grow up and like play wow love wow and then they like get their degree and they start looking for a job as a game designer and they get they end up at blizzard and they get to pour all that fresh new passion into the game that they've loved the whole time like we have that's a good thing you know what was crazy before we started the interview when we, when we were just getting set up somebody was like somebody in chat said hey i've been watching you since i was 13 and this patch of wow is is going to be the first like 
launch that I've been a part of. And I'm really excited for it. Like, that's insane. That's crazy. Somebody's been watching my videos since they were 13, and now they're working on WoW. It, I think it really helps you not have that, like, really weird, like, WoW is my ex-girlfriend attitude, you know what I mean? Like, you're like, oh yeah, that was really fun checking out another game. Let's go back to see what's, what, what WoW's up to. For example, like, I've really enjoyed New World, and I've really, I, I really enjoyed Lost Ark, and I'm going to play more of that, too. I might, I might want to check out New World's Arena, for sure. Um, but then you come back to WoW, and you're like, damn, WoW is actually, like, really good. I don't, I don't really ever feel like WoW's not good, to be honest with you, like, sometimes I feel like playing other stuff and that's fine, but like, I feel like it definitely helps keep that attitude away, where it's like, you know, like the really like kind of weird salty attitude that people can get sometimes. I feel like it might help to avoid that, just be like some healthy refreshment, you know? Because WoW's a, WoW's a pretty, it's, it's, a, it's a game that's been around for a long time and people kind of know how to play at this point, but it also takes like a little bit of an investment to like, you know, for you to get good at it. Like, it's hard for you to expect, expect to really just be like super good at anything right off the bat, right? There's a lot to WoW. There's a lot to learn. There's a lot to to focus on and get better at. Like, like WoW feels like home to me. And like, sometimes it's good to go on adventures and learn more about other games and learn about yourself and have fun, have a cool experience and share that experience with other people. But WoW will always be my favorite game because WoW, WoW keeps cranking out new content too. And, and there was a new patch that was, that was released for WoW. Um, was it like a few weeks into Lost Ark or something like that? And I was just like, man, this is a little bit, a little bit too much fun right now. I, I'm, I'm a bit of a WoW veteran, but just I, I, like, I'm basically like going through the, almost like the leveling content at this point. Like, I'm just sort of doing this, the story stuff. Hero healing class is gonna be cool. Yeah, it's gonna be busted probably, huh? I'm gonna be a dragon. <laughs> Burn it! This was the whole. Yes, yeah, Sylvanas, you done goofed. And you slaughtered all of them. How she messed up, bro. Those innocent lives. This was beyond life and death. There was no other path to true freedom. I'm not How buying can it. Can you not see that? I see what you are. Murderer. Monster. Butcher. Why can I not escape this torment? Damn. The Jailer has severed their bond and condemned her to endlessly relive her atrocities. Brutal. So long as her soul remains divided, she cannot wake. Mm. Maybe she shouldn't. She's the only one. Got a point there, Bane. Oh, damn, the wound linkage. Oh, is this Sylvanas? Well met, Ranger General. What is this? Oh, snap. I who are you? Someone who shared your fate. Fell I didn't even put that together. Of the very same prince. Arthas. I died trying to stop that monster. Only to wake up haunted. By one with my face. That banshee is you. No. I cannot accept that. Her path began. That'd be intense. And yours ended. And you've seen the decisions she made. Never in a thousand lifetimes would I betray everything I stood for. You can't possibly understand. Whoa, dude. Whoa, dude. You gonna play PvP to Shadowlands? Yeah, I mean, I, I have a Shadowlands rank one title. I mean, it's Sinful Gladiator. It's from the first season of Shadowlands. But we'll play more, yeah. We'll play more PvP. But yeah, we do gotta wrap it up here pretty soon, guys. So if you guys are hyped about the WoW streams, hyped about the Lost Ark streams, just enjoying the vibes, make sure you guys follow along. It has been a crazy awesome day. Very glad that we got our first look at Xerath Mortis. It's a really nice little zone, man. I like it. I'm excited to, to do more here, get my character going. Probably have to get into some raids, Mythic Plus, PvP this week to, I guess, just get like some gear on this guy. Start working on that so I can start making my tier sets as well. But definitely a really fun uh, stream today. We put in some work, 
It's going to be another big day tomorrow. Like I said, new Lost Ark content, sponsored stream in the afternoon as well, and then uh, there's more evening grind. We could even start off with WoW in the evening and then go into Lost Ark if we wanted to. That might be a fine way to do it. We'll uh, turn this quest in, grab these, pick this up tomorrow on another epic day of games and gains. <laughs> Been a great day, though. Thanks for all the love, all the uh, welcome backs, all the good vibes. Looking forward to much more of that tomorrow and many, many days to come. But until then, we'll see you guys next time. Peace.